I see a lot of people using real big blades for real kind of small, intricate detail. And a lot of people are cutting past the knuckle. Now, most hairdressers will not have any tension through that part of their finger. So the reason why you don't need a nine inch blade to cut something that long is because it's a waste of blade. So the reason why you have smaller blades on these is I've got average fingers. Never heard that one before. <laughs> That's average disgusting. Fingers. Stop it, you dirty bastards. <laughs> right, so you see how the blade actually goes straight the way to my first knuckle? Right, so that means I can hold that whole section there and cut once and it's gone. So if you've got like a nine inch blade or whatever you've got and you're holding it out here to cut something that's just there, no need. Keep it everything ergonomic, so these are I use these a lot. What I find when people actually do cut with them as well is when you actually, if you've got a scissor that pushes hair, what's the natural reaction as a hairdresser to counteract the push? It's that pulling back motion when you do it. And that's how people will operate with this. So what you do is pull back to stop the push forward. It doesn't make a lot of sense when you're doing that because if you cut a straight line using that and running it six times across, think about how many times you're doing that within a haircut, that within a section. It's probably not great on your body. So we came up with this called the manta ray, which we've literally pushed that center screw Sorry. forward. And so the Sorry. blades and the handle, the handle's a lot longer than the blade. So I don't know if anyone here does like, um, like house burglars on the side or anything like that, but if you've got like a bolt cutter and you want to you want to cut through something, you need long handles, short blades, and that's for the leverage of it. It's the same steel they use in like pruners and stuff like that. It's not that the metal's stronger for it, it's more the fact that you've got better leverage. Excellent. And this is how this works. You have a really, really long, long handle, small yeah, blades, really, really fine. It means as you close it, you can just literally come in and pull the trigger on each time. Pulling a trigger on that means you've got one straight line, you're cutting it once, go back. So for me, it's literally pick up, comb, check, cut, Bang. Clean every single time.